Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dark Deck, and today we're starting a brand new series. And can you guess what we're going to be playing? Yes, Stardew Valley. I've had it recommended to me a fair few times at this point. Um, the main ones I can think that have recommended it to me are Jemar and um, Danielle from my, my Discord server. Um... I've got like 62 minutes in this game. Somebody once upon a time was meant to teach me how to play it and um, we never really got around to um, doing anything like that. So I don't really know much about this game. I've got none of the achievements, anything like that. So um, yeah, I'm going to be needing your guys' hints and tips throughout it. I know this is one of them games where you can go around and like make friends with everybody in the village and you can like potentially get a wife and stuff like that. Not sure how much we're going to be going down the social side of this game, but um, yeah, thought we'd give it a go. It's a nice relaxing game from what I know of the game, which is very little, but um, yeah, it should hopefully be a nice relaxing series. Anyway, like we do at the start of every series, if you'd like to take a look in the description below, there are three links there for me, one for Discord, one for Patreon, and one for Twitch. Discord, obviously, you can come be part of the community, join in with the chat, stuff like that, give me tips on there. It's a little bit easier to give me uh, feedback on stuff if you can do it directly rather than through the YouTube comments. Um, the link to Twitch is so you could come watch me stream live. Sa uh, Sunday afternoon, sorry, not Saturday afternoons, 5 o'clock UK time. Um, I'm currently doing 7 Days to Die, a uh, horde night every night, as you can see from the VODs that I cut up and upload onto YouTube at the minute. Um, and then the final link for Patreon is where you can support the channel. And um, that gets you some nice different things on Discord. We can join different rooms. You get name in the game perks and stuff like that. You get your name on the outro screen. I'd like to come up with some new rewards as well. It, it feels like the ones that I've got for people at the minute are a bit stale and you don't really get much for supporting the channel. But it's all greatly appreciated if you'd like to go take a look there as well. Below them three links, there are six more. There are two for Calthalus, two for Night Raven, and two for Teacot. Two of those three, uh, Night Raven and Teacot are my admins. It's their YouTube and their Twitch links. Calthalus is Night Raven's husband. I won't say wife this time. Um, he built the computer that I've been recording all these games on. Um, pretty much any time anybody's got any technical problems, they get directed to him on my Discord. And it's also his YouTube and his Twitch channels that are there below. All of them play games along the lines of Phasmophobia, This is a Ghost, Demonologist, Ghost Hunting games like that, as well as Seven Days to Die. I know Teacot um, does videos about wrestling stuff. Raven plays games like the story games, like um, The Quarry and stuff like that. Uh, Cal Phallus plays one of the car simulator games. It always reminds me of Gran Turismo. So yeah, go take a look at their links as well. Show them some love. But um, I think that's enough of promoting everybody and myself. Let's let's press this new game button here. <clears throat> my, my voice has gone weird. Right. There's no actual options in game to turn things down. So I'm doing this through the, um, the volume mixer. I think I need to turn this down a touch more. That seems like it'll be okay. Sorry if I just blew anybody's eardrums out with that. Um, so what do we want to look like? Um, name. We are going to be Dank. It's going to be Dank's farm. And favourite thing is farming. I'm just going to... Yeah, why not? Put that there. Um, standard farm, Riverland farm, forest farm. I think we're just going to go standard because I don't know what I'm doing. It's got to be a doggo. Um, excuse me. Where is the Westy looking one? I've even got the dad, dad dog shirt on with Luna on it. Um, I mean, Luna's got pointy ears. Can we imagine this is white and then that looks kind of Westy-ish? Um, I am pretty much white as a ghost. Blue? We could have been blue? I think we'll just go like that. Technically, that last one, oh my god. An emo fringe. I've got a bit of a central part and we'll go for that one. Hair colour is going to be pretty much black. Luckily, my camera's not that good. You guys can't see my... Uh... In fact, we can go like that. I was going to see you guys can't really see my grey. That's black and grey to me. Um, eye colour, I'm not particularly bothered. I have got brown eyes. That'll do fine. Um, I kind of like the apron that we had on. <clears throat> apron? It wasn't an apron, was it? It's like dungarees. Hmm. That wasn't bad. The red shirt looked pretty good. 
You know what? We're going with that. Is he even wearing pants there? They're pretty short shorts, my dude. I guess normal pants that are going to be black. Um, oh, we can go with beards. I mean, at the minute, I've got a pretty full beard. I think we want that one. My God, I look homeless. Skip intro. We'll leave the intro because, like I say, it's been that long since I loaded this game up. And I've only played an hour, so I probably skipped the intro anyway. Press OK. Let's get into it. I know it's a game about farming. I know it's a game about social interaction and stuff like that. But I'm going to shut up now. I think that'll make quite a nice thumbnail, won't it? Although that's not me, that's... And for a very special grandson, I want you to have this sealed envelope. <clears throat> Another game where I've got to do loads of reading. <laughs> no, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. I have none. Now listen close. I'm listening. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. Game's getting straight into it, isn't it? And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. Wow. Do, do we want to pick up the um, <laughs> the tone a little bit, game? When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. Okay. Oh, isn't it not? What's he doing with his hand? Now, let Grandpa rest. XX years later. Is that meant to be 20 years later? Joja, join us, thrive. It's work time. The work light was flashing. We've got cameras watching everybody. Yeah, this this is pretty grim. Where's where's our character? I'm right there. Oh my god, it has actually got a ponytail at the back, hasn't it? That looks like a ponytail to me. Did I actually pick the right hairstyle for me? Side part and a ponytail. It's not in a ponytail at the minute, like, but generally it is when I'm at work. I guess today's the day. <clears throat> Dear Dank, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. It's actually like he's talking to me. What the? Uh, the same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people. Oh, no. Can't play this game anymore. So I dropped everything and moved into a place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy, Dank's farm weird that he'd named it Dax Fomp. Anyway, uh, it's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honour the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. Yes. I am still alive. It, it's my real name. I, I don't tend to use it. I don't like my real name, but I am alive still. Uh, say hi to the old guy for me, will you? Enough of the old guy. I get old guy enough at work, god damn it. With it set on some new staff, and one of them's got a tendency of calling me old. She said I looked older than my than my old manager. I was about to say how old she was, but that's just rude. Let's not do that. <clears throat> yeah, I wasn't impressed. In fact, in her interview, I was like, nah, we're not employing her. Absolutely not. Nope. She's quite funny, genuinely, but calling me old is not going to get her anywhere. So, we're on our way to Stardew Valley. There we are. Hello, you must be Dag. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent... Yes, I'm a mayor. Sent me here to fetch you and show you the ways to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here if you'll follow me... I don't think this is going to come across as being too loud music-wise, but... He's going to clean my farm! Have you seen the state of it? What's he cleaned up? This is Dank's farm. It's been annihilated with the looks of it. it. Yeah. My genuine reaction. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good old... There's no old there. There's some good old soil underneath that mess. Uh, with a little dedication, you'll have it cleared up in no time. <clears throat> Does anybody know that I have OCD and I can't be having clutter around the place? And here we are, your new home. 
that's got a hole in the deck. Looks like the wall's a little bit caved in. Ah, the new farmer. He has. He's got a ponytail. Yes. Welcome. I'm Lewis, mayor of the town uh, of Pelican Town. I'm I'm Lewis, actually Lewis. Uh, you know, everybody's been asking about you. It's not every day that somebody new moves in. It's quite a big deal. Is it now? It really. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. Air quotes. It's um, it's dilapidated. Rustic, that's one way to put it. Crusty. Uh, don't describe it as crusty. Might be a little more apt, though. Rude! Oh my god. The mayor is actually Night Raven incarnated. Rude! Don't listen uh, to her, Dak. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you'll buy one of her house upgrades. Rude! Hm. Anyway, you must be tired from your long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. I'm wondering if this could be turned on just... A tiny weeny bit more. Uh, oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I assume this one. Um, I'll come by during the night to collect it. That's not weird at all. Well, good luck. Why? Why would you? Why would you come through during the night? The last game I played that was even close to this was Sunhaven, and I actually put a fair few hours into it. So, WSD to move. I don't know if my face is going to be in the way. By the way, it seems a good fit for now. Shift to run, although you seem to be running by default, shift is technically walk, and right click to check. Parsnip seeds, yours. You receive 15 parsnip seeds, here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. Dude, such a nice guy. Um, I don't think I actually want this. Um, I'm, I'm not bothered about any of that. We've got an axe, we've got a hoe, we've got a watering can, we've got a pickaxe, we've got a scythe, and we've got parsnip seeds. Lovely. <clears throat> Down on this bottom right, I believe this is an energy bar right here. And if we swap to this, I, I assume for the grass we'll want to use the sickle. Scythe. It's not a sickle, it's a scythe. Just going to clear the farm out a little bit. Mixed seeds, okay. Um, we're going to need the pickaxe for the rocks, I guess. My inventory is going to be a state to start with, isn't it? Is my energy actually going down? Yeah, it's going down. It just didn't seem to be moving at all. I wondered if I'd um, set it up somehow that I'd like turned off stamina use. In a game like this, it seems like you wouldn't want to do that. Um, can we swap these tools around, please? I'd like... Is it I for inventory? B? What? Oh, it's escape. Oh, okay. Um, we'll put that there, that there, that there. I think that's a bit of a better fit. I don't know if we're meant to be chopping down trees that are that small, but... You can click and hold. Brilliant. I haven't got to keep button bashing. Wow, that uses up a fair chunk of energy. What do we get? Sap. Hmm... I think we'll get rid of this stump and we can take out this rock right here. What's with all the butterflies? They're everywhere. Your axe isn't strong enough to break this stump. Oh, okay. My bad. Right. I think we've cleared out around here a little bit. Um, how many did we get? 15 parsnip seeds. A, a nice 3 by 5 grid. Why? 3... Four, five. Can I undo this? <laughs> Maybe we'll have another farm right there that's three by five. Maybe we should plant the parsnip seeds. And then probably go out. My energy's a little bit on the low side, isn't it? One minute, I just need to I just need to clear this grass out. And I just need to clear this. Yeah, that, that's good. We can leave that there. Yeah, that'll be fine. 
One there, one there, one there. Oh, you can click and hold this as well. Um, I assume this all needs watering. Oh, you can't actually just keep watering on the same spot. That's not what we want. Oh, they all look good to go. Can we, we've got skills in here. Farming, mining, foraging, fishing and combat. Nothing in the wallet. So sure, I like how it tells me they're all single. I already said that's probably not what we're going to be looking into. Crafting. I need 50 wood to make a wooden chest. And we are on 37. Could I um, just get a little bit more wood, please? Just so I can make a basic chest to store all of my crap in. Am I, am I meant to be shouting timber? Seriously? I'm too short. Probably be more energy efficient to not chop these. Press escape again. Go to craft it. What have we got? Collections. Options. Um, I like auto run being on. Portraits. Gamepad. Item so uh, stowing. Slingshot bio mode. I don't know what half of this is. Yep. Use control style menus. No. I'm not using the controller. Oh, you can turn the volume up and down in here. I want full screen, please. Yeah, it shouldn't really be messing with this stuff while I'm uh, mid-recording. Apologies, I'll stop that. No. I don't think we need to play with anything else in here. Right, we can, we'd come in here to make a chest. So if we go to six, and if we just place this, I don't know, up here. And we can throw all of this stuff in there for now. I'll go colour picker. I'm not actually that bothered. Organise that, add to existing stacks. Beautiful. Um, we've not got much energy left. <clears throat> Journal F, getting started. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, then use a seed packet on the tilled soil to sow a crop. Water every day until the crop is ready to harvest. Cultivate and harvest in... Uh, well, we've got to cultivate and harvest the parsnips. Introduction. Um, it would be nice to just... A uh, nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. I can say gesture, by the way, just apparently not now. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. I've got to greet all them people. Seriously. I have no idea where anything is. Just to get that out there. There's a squirrel! Can I just take these? Leek, daffodil. Okay. I assume running around will use energy as well, right? I can hear Luna barking downstairs. She'll be fine. The other half's down there with her. Plus 40 energy. Can I just... I eat that oh E opens that as well eat the league hmm yeah that's better opening that with E <clears throat> E is a, always a good side if, uh, sign if you don't even know the hotkeys Luna's going absolutely mental who's this dude Harvey it's a pleasure to meet you I'm Harvey the local doctor Regular checkup medical procedures for all the residents in the Pelican Town. It's rewarding work. Okay. Hi, bye. There's going to be freaking people everywhere, isn't there? Like 20 of them or so. Uh, what have we got here? Events. Lewis's but Obviously, Vincent's birthday. Egg Festival. Haley's birthday. Pam's birthday. Sh yeah, I get it. Oh, who are you? Abigail? Oh, that's right. I heard somebody new was moving into the old farm. 
Yep. Okay. Pleased to meet you. Uh, Evelyn. Why, hello and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. No? I won't be calling you Granny. Evelyn? Here we go in here. Here we go. Just walk into some dude's house. Uh, George. Hmm. It's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way, now. Buzz off. That's me. Me when I'm older. Can, can we go in here? You're not good enough friends with Alex to enter his bedroom. He's kind of busy as well. You imagine you're there working out in your bedroom, apparently topless, and somebody that you... Oh, who's that? And somebody that you've never met before just walks in and is just like, Hi, I'm Lewis. Oh, dang. Sorry. Caroline? Hello, you must be Dank, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. All right, Caroline. Uh, what's happening in Pierre's? Oh, we've got two new people in here. Who are you? Leah? Hello, it's nice to meet you. We, we've met you already. Who are you? Can I not just talk to you in person? Yeah? Obviously, it's his freaking shop. Hey, it's Mr. Dak. Just Dak will do. Mr. Dak's my father. Uh, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local G uh, general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the best place to get them. I'll also buy products from you for a good price. Good to know, my dude. Good to know. Two grand? I assume that will be useful later down the line. I guess we're not good enough friends to go in whoever's bedroom that is. Anybody back here? The Christ is going in on in there. Looks like some cult sort of stuff. Can I, can I partake in? No. It's loaded with fresh veggies. Let's help yourself take. Take them now. <clears throat> now I think uh, I think we can leave Pierre's shop. Probably didn't want to use that um, leak that we'd got, but anyway. Um, right, where else are we going? I'm not going to remember my way around here for a little while. You're Abigail. I'm definitely not going to remember everybody's names. I've already been in there. Watch, who are you? Maru? Uh, oh, aren't you the one that just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Okay. We're just going to go into this private domicile. Uh, Penny? Oh, hello, I'm Penny. Okay. Where else have we got to go? Pick up truck. Can we scoot through here and break into somebody else's house? Oh, no, we spoke to you already. <clears throat> Nobody in here. Wasn't worth breaking in for. Is that a library? There were some books around there. Graveyard that way. Who are you? Elliot. I thought you were female. Sorry. Um, ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in a little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Lovely. <clears throat> oh, this must be what you're on about then. Can we just pick any of this stuff up? Apparently I can pick that one up. What do these do? Nothing at the minute. Okay. Yeah, I saw the house. We'll go back round to it. Who are you? Um, it's Lewis. So, how was your first night in the old cottage? It was fine, thank you. I assume this is his fishing shop. Gone fishing, I'll be back tomorrow. Rude. Wait. Is that Lewis's fishing shop? If I just ran past him? Introductions. We're on 12 out of tw uh, 28 people. We're not even halfway there yet. Is this seagull one of them? Nope. Right, they're having campfires down on the beach. We can't pick any of that jazz up. What's going off here then? With 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed. I've literally just got here. I don't think it's... Okay. Um, I don't think it's um, our job to do. We've just moved in. It feels like we might be stepping on somebody's toes, like, you know, an engineer or a carpenter or something like that. Maybe they want to repair it first. Sewer down there. Don't think we need to go that way. Can I come up here? Yes, I can. Who are you? Oh. Get here. Haley. Hallie, even. Oh, you're the new farmer boy, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I am. Is there anybody else in here that I can annoy? Doesn't really look like it. 
Emily. We've not met Emily yet. Have we met Emily? Oh, God knows. There's that many people. Are you Emily? You're Leah. I'm around 5.50 p.m. Okay. Who are you? Don't go into that bedroom. I just wanted to talk. Jesus. Who are you, Tim? Uh, Vincent. Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. That that doesn't matter. Don't do it. Uh, we've got Jody. Oh, you aren't, aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Rude. How did you imagine me to be? I just look like Link, just with a red tunic on and black hair. That's why I went with this. It looks like Link's tunic. At least in the Game Boy versions, anyway. Who are you lot? I believe I've spoke to you already. Don't sit on the bench next to them, that's weird. Why can I not talk to you? Dog. I spoke to you already. Uh, where else have we got to go? we go anywhere down this way? We've not been across this bridge yet. Oh, who are we in? Uh, Clint. Hi, uh, I'm Clint. Brilliant. It's locked, 8pm to 6pm. I guess everybody's getting ready for bedtime then. <clears throat> well, that's rubbish. I was hoping to stay up late and find people. Join us, thrive. Who are you, you lot? Can I not talk to you lot as like actual people? Um, how are you doing today? I don't believe we've met. Oh, Morris. I'm Morris. Jojo's customer satisfaction representative. When you decide you want to become a Jojo member, I'll be your, uh, delighted to help you make your... Ex None of that sentence came out correctly. I'll be delighted to help make your transmission transition a joyous experience. That's wonderful. Is anybody shopping? Nope. Gloss, toothpaste, and soap. Brilliant. I, I kind of work in a shop. I know how it generally works. Ooh. We're getting quite dark now. Maybe we should get heading back to the farm. I don't know if you get told off for being out at night or anything. And where the Christ is my farm? I'm just going to keep going left. Is this is this the way to my farm? Is this the way to Amarillo? Yes, this is the way to my farm. So... If I hadn't got to interact with people all the time, constantly, that would be beautiful. I'd rather not. But um, if we need to do it, then we need to do it. Let's just trim a little bit more of this rubbish back. Um, I wonder if I've got enough energy to chop another tree down. Now, one of the few things I do remember the last time I played this. You do pass out if your energy hits a zero, so let's not let that happen. More sap. Mixed seeds, lovely. We've got all this to clear down here as well. Jesus. So all this stuff. Wonder how late you can stay out. I'm pretty sure I know the answer to that, but I just can't remember. You're starting to feel exhausted. I think that's a sign for us to go wrap it up. Inventory is full. Oh, you only get your freaking hot bar at the minute. Well, that's rubbish. Take this. Do that. Just throw all of this in there. There's no point me... Trying to like put it in any sort of order that I'd like at the minute. And go sleep. Go to sleep for the night, yes. I think we could leave our first episode there, couldn't we, really? And, before, well, yeah, no, we're, we're, we are going to leave it there. Current funds, 500 gold. Total earnings, zero. We need to keep these parsnips going, but um, we'll look into that in tomorrow's episode. Like I say, I don't really know what I'm doing with this game, but it'd be nice to explore it. I've heard a lot of things about it, and I know people have wanted me to play it for quite a while. So, um, yeah. 
Hopefully you guys enjoy watching me play it. Like I said at the start of the episode, go take a look at my three links in the description below and the six links that are for Calthalus, Night Raven, and Teacock. Be greatly appreciated. But yeah, if you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Always helps out with the new series, gets it out there, gets more people watching it. We can grow the channel and I can keep doing this more often. Um, any comments or feedback you've got about the game are going to be greatly appreciated. I'm going to need to know tips and tricks and stuff like that. And if you like what you see, feel free to subscribe as well. Or uh, go look through my channel for other content along these lines. We've not played anything that's like this to a degree, but then again, we kind of have. Dave the Diver had a little bit of farming in and making friends with people and stuff like that. So, yeah, similar sorts of things are on the channel already. But yeah, thanks very much, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.